okay i connected your server now yes. so first i will try to check whether you install docker or not yeah docker is there already so now i will execute ls of okay port number 8000 is already enabled i can see 8000 is uh, already listening yes then then something is already deployed i think right yes yes ah uh, see something is already deployed i can see nginx and django app this is an 8000 and this is 80 curl local host 8000 Okay, this is showing a uh, curl local host eight thousand reset by peer. Okay, mm. starting Docker logs. Hmm hmm hmm. Okay, okay. So, have you created any database? No. No. Okay. See the problem is your server is trying to connect the DB, but you don't have any DB. Understood? Yes. So that is what you are not able to access, uh, like uh, your application. So now let me sort out yes. this issue. So we can simply sort this issue out by just creating a database. Okay. So first I will delete your container. Then I will just rebuild again. Then I'll show you how it works. You already turn on this port number, right? Eight thousand. Yes. Yes. Okay, so I'm just hitting this IP, and I will check port number eight thousand is working or not. This is not working now, so I can't be reached. Right? Yes. Okay, I'm just executing Docker ps. So two Docker's are there. So this is port number eighty. So this should work. Yeah, this is working. Jenkins is working, but uh, this is not working. Like uh, this Django app. Django app, yes. Hmm. I'm remo removing this two container. Okay, uh, this is unnecessary now. Okay, I removed. Now I will make Aram. Okay, Docker images. Okay, so I can see there is a MySQL image also, but it's not uh, deployed. Fine. Now let me quickly go to the GitHub which you shared some time back. Yes. So requirement Python, Node.js, React. Assemble yes. Node app with the React and Django. First we have to clone the GitHub. Uh, Docker build Node app. Docker run minus d eight thousand uh, app latest. Uh, Nginx install Nginx reverse proxy to make this application available. Okay, fine. Uh, so let me quickly go to Docker compose dot yaml. So here we have a nginx container. Okay, already is there. Django build is there. Django app container name Django container, and this is enabling at port number eight thousand uh, with the Gunicon server. Mm, then they are doing database also. Fine. So what I'll do now? Uh, Django nodes. I'll clone this first. Okay. Let's go to server again. Uh, git clone. This is quite simple, man. Let me try. Okay, I just cloned this application Django Nodes app. So I'll go to this directory. Under this directory, you can see something called Docker Compose, right? Yes. Okay. So let's execute sudo docker compose up minus d. Okay. So now, what is the issue? Uh, Nodes app with a default driver creating db content error. Db content Cannot create container for service DB conflict. The container and DB container is already in use by container. Okay, you have to remove or rename the container to be able to use that. Okay, Docker. P. I think we need to kill the uh, the, uh, the containers. Mm hmm. So there are certain containers you are still using it. That's what uh, you can see yeah, here. My SQL, right? It's already there. We have to remove it. Yes, yes. Docker RM. Docker. Uh, yeah, uh, Docker. Arm, I have to use this and this. Okay, it's removed now. I hope everything is clear. Yes. 
docker ps minus a nothing we don't have so i will execute this command once again now this is creating all the containers docker ps now this is created django app mysql right so curl yes. local host 8000 docker ps i think this is just starting let's wait for some time let's wait yeah mm, docker logs okay my sql is seems working okay this is seems working only my sql in no db initialization started everything is perfectly working docker ps 3306 Okay, this is healthy now now just call again okay now your application seems perfectly fine if i put uh, this uh, url uh, now you can see my notes okay so uh, haven't you used any port number here i have i have used you can see here docker ps so we have a nginx right so this nginx yes. will work as a reverse proxy which means you only need to connect your uh, IP address. So this will connect your Django application. Django. See, uh, Django application port number 8000. But here you only need to connect port number 80. Nginx will connect your Django port number 8000 internally. Okay. okay. It's a reverse proxy kind of thing. And this is connected to DB and DB also connecting. And uh, now it seems working perfectly. That's what this is your not application. So now you can create. Can I check from here notes. once? Sorry. Can I check from here once? Yeah, yeah, sure, sure. Let me unshare my screen then. Okay. 